Empire of the Bored Apes, Yuga Labs has grown beyond the wild success of its Bored Ape Yacht Club collection to become an NFT powerhouse with a $4 billion valuation and big plans in the metaverse. That's why co-founders Wiley Arono and Greg Solano and CEO Nicole Muna share a spot on Coindesk's most influential 2022. Announcing, an NFT of the work above is available for bidding at auction on Coinbase NFT. A percentage of the sale will go to charity. In the 18 months since its launch of the wildly successful non-fungible token, NFT, Project Board Ape Yacht Club, BAYC, Yuga Labs has taught the nascent Web3 industry how to build a community around an NFT project and maintain that momentum despite market volatility. Now it's clear that Yuga Labs had much bigger ambitions to become a multi-tiered enterprise inspired by the creative thinking of animation studios like Pixar, by acquiring a handful of other character-driven NFT collections and creating virtual worlds where people can interact with them. To bring about this vision, Yuga raised $450 million in March led by venture capital firm Andresen Horowitz, A16Z, attaining a $4 billion valuation along the way. We see ourselves as like a creative first company, Solano said. Our DNA is thinking of the things we want to do, then figure out the creative stories that we want to tell, and then we figure out how we're going to do them and work back from there. What's astonishing about Yuga's growth is how fast it has been. It was only back in February 2021 that four friends, Greg Solano, aka Gargamel, Wiley Arono, aka Gordon Goner, Karem Adelai, aka Emperor Tomato Ketchup, and Zashan Ali, aka No Sass, set out to join the club of crypto by co-founding Yuga Labs when the idea of growing an online community around NFT profile pictures, PFP, was still relatively nascent. Arono and Solano met in college and bonded over their shared interests in literature and gaming. What set the bake apart from other PFP collections, is the men's ability to spin a narrative tale around the characters. That's when we came up with Bored Ape Yacht Club. The idea was that it was this place for degenerates to go, right? Because that's who we were, Arono and Solano told Jeff Wilson in September 2021. Over the past year, the company has injected capital into growing its portfolio of brands. It's Genesis Bake. Project an evolutionary NFT project called Mutant Ape Yacht Club, MAYC, a companion project called Bored Ape Kennel Club, BAKC, CryptoPunks, a legacy NFT project that it acquired from Larva Labs in March Mebits, another NFT project that it acquired in the deal for CryptoPunks its other side metaverse project, which is currently in its testing phase in November, Yuga Labs announced the acquisition of Beeple's Web3 ecosystem Wenu and its flagship NFT project, 10KTF. The stream of steady product launches and high-value acquisitions has positioned Yuga Labs as one of the top NFT brands, with its product lineup consistently ranking among the top collections on top NFT marketplace OpenSea. Still, some have pushed back against the company as the first NFT monopoly in a space that is supposed to champion decentralization and individual ownership. I think the idea of a monopoly comes from people who don't understand the impact we've had on the space in the form of decentralization, Solano said in an email. The company has also increased its staff from 11 to 110 people, formalizing its leadership team by bringing on CEO Nicole Muniz, a childhood friend of Arono's who founded and managed a creative agency, as well as adding a chief gaming officer, vice president of product and vice president of communications. Solano said he and Arono has led the creative vision of Yuga since the early days, including all aspects of the creative and strategic processes, while Muniz has been key in building out the infrastructure of the company and helping it scale. I sat down with Arono and Solano at the Institute of Contemporary Art during Art Basel Miami, where they were celebrating the installation of the newly donated CryptoPunk No. 305, the third NFT to enter the museum's collection. While the event attracted leaders and influencers from the crypto and fine art spaces, the founders appeared still to be navigating the overnight celebrity status they earned after their identities were leaked in a controversial piece by BuzzFeed News in February. The 230-somethings are proud and maybe even surprised their passion project has exploded into such a cultural phenomenon, with celebrities including Snoop Dogg, Justin Bieber, Steph Curry, Eminem, and Madonna, and thousands of other collectors proudly sporting as their profile pictures the cartoon apes, which were designed under their creative direction by a team of freelance illustrators including All Seeing Seneca, Migwasher, Thomas Dagley, and two others that prefer to remain anonymous. Yuga Labs was arguably the first NFT project to integrate previously niche concepts such as using a flat price model, adding long-term utility, offering surprise airdrops, publishing a project roadmap and giving its holders full intellectual IP rights, allowing them to use the likeness of their characters for commercial purposes. This has paved the way for dozens of community-created projects and counting, including a California burger joint called Bored and Hungry, a beverage company called Ape Water and a music group called Kingship made up entirely of ape avatars. From day one of the Bored Ape Yacht Club, 
the community has been empowered and encouraged to commercialize their NFTs. It's core to why we've seen such rapid growth, Arono said in an email. This approach, while initially perceived as risky, has proved to be key to the company's success. Indeed, enabling bake owners to earn money from their PFPs may also be key to the community's loyalty. At the Web Summit conference in Lisbon in November, Muniz emphasized brands' ability to turn previously passive consumers into owners of their own content. In recent months, this shift has been observed through an increase in NFT trademark filings and a growing number of IP licensing structures used across NFT projects. Yuga's rapid growth and community building efforts over the last year are in service to a much greater vision, the development of its ambitious Other Side Metaverse project. As the co-founder describes it, Other Side will be an interoperable, gamified world-building platform that will turn NFTs into playable characters. We see it as the platform for our communities and many other communities to come together, Solano said. Other side, which blends mechanics from massively multiplayer online role-playing games, MMORPG, and Web3-enabled virtual worlds, sold 55,000 other deed NFTs linked to virtual land ownership in April, raking in about $320 million. In July, Yuga organized its first tech demo for thousands of other deed holders, which it dubbed its first trip, giving the community a glimpse into the future where virtual identities are intertwined and owning an NFT is your key to unlocking the metaverse. We see. Other side is the intersection of a lot of these ideas, Solano said. It's where we see the next evolution of the space going towards. We wanted to create a truly code-developed, egalitarian metaverse that was fun, Arono added. Update, December 5, 2114 UTC, added Migwasher and Thomas Dagley to the list of illustrators who worked on Bored Apes. 